y'all welcome back to the channel today is friday august 24th this is officially my last weekend before school starts and i feel like everything that i need to do is just creeping up on me like it didn't hit me till yesterday when i started getting emails that my classes were rolling out and i realized that i'm not organized whatsoever like i thought i was but i'm most definitely not so today we're gonna do a lot of errands firstly my dumb car is having more car problems it's just the brake pad so i'm not too worried but i want to get on it soon because they're screeching i also made a whole notes thing because that's how much I thought I have to do. I don't have to do all this today. I'm going to try to do it over the weekend, but I have zero plans today. So I'm going to try to get majority of it done today. Second thing, I want to go through all my classes. I've been doing that this morning, so I'm getting more familiar with it, but I really want to see what assignments I'll have due throughout the week because I'm taking five classes. That's the most I've ever taken. And if you guys have taken more than me, then shut your pie hole because this is stressful to me. It seems like every class has three assignments due a week, which is a little little crazy and intense. So just going through my classes and then I want to go shopping. Big surprise, I want to go look for a lunchbox because you guys, I think I'm going to try to start meal planning. Because one thing that I think a lot of people do, but specifically I do this way too much, I eat too much food <laughs> or I eat out too much and I'm trying to literally just stop that because it will save me so much money and I think this will be fun and keep me busy so I have some food ideas I just want to do like little bento boxes to start so they're easy but if I was able to do this every day in elementary middle school like I should be able to pack my lunch every day now but I do want to try to start doing that so I can save money and then I have a video I need to edit that doesn't need to be edited today but I figured I would do it today I want to get my steps in so maybe go on a walk or work out and I I think I'm gonna return my camera, which I am so sad to say. I don't know if it's because I bought this one used, but I've had the worst experience with it. Like genuinely, it's so bad. I've never had a camera this bad and I, not that I've had many cameras, but this one sucks. Like the lighting is weird and then it will get black lines on the screen and that pisses me off. And then like the photo mode always has a weird like, I don't know how to show it. <laughs> It always has a weird filter on it and no matter what I do like with the ISO aperture or anything It just doesn't look right. So I think I'm actually gonna return it Which is so crazy for me to say it's gonna be fine though because I'm gonna get $700 back and I'll be happy I just need to I think I was gonna wait like a couple more days to decide because I have till October But I think I like just don't want it and I want a Canon G7X like let's be real I also want to clean my room like I'm telling you guys there's so much stuff I need to do this weekend, but it's okay I'm just gonna vlog for you guys and you're gonna enjoy it. Okay, I'll update. Hey guys, car is dropped off. I have no idea what's wrong with my car, but they're going to check it, call me, let me know. I'm really hoping it's just the brake pads. There is a big chance it's also the rotors. But I, if it's the rotors, it's only the back two rotors. So we should be fine. Anyways, I just got this cute cat notepad. Oh my gosh, there's a balloon guy. <laughs> I got this from the Japanese market. It's like a little to-do list. I'll show you guys. But I just love the little cat guys. And yeah, I think I just have to shop on Amazon, which I think is so boring because I like buying stuff in person, but of course I'll do a haul whenever I buy stuff. Okay, y'all, I just got back from work. Ever since school started, it's been real busy on Saturdays. I honestly have a lot I want to do today. As much as I want to lay in my bed and watch TikTok, there's actually some things I want to get done, such as cleaning my room, planning for all my classes, and making sure I'm going to have enough time to do all of them. Uh, I have to do something for Chick-fil-A later tonight. I did get home and I got food. I'll show it to you guys. I got a Cobb salad with spicy breaded chicken. I think I've showed you guys this. It's so amazing and good. I feel like I just cleaned my room, but I really want to deep clean it. Gonna vacuum, of course. Oh, I have an Amazon package. Okay, I have some Amazon packages. Yesterday, I really didn't do much except for get that cute notepad because I realized if I wanted cute stationary stuff, it's probably all gonna be on Amazon. I didn't get a whole bunch, but I did get some new pens. Aren't these adorable? These are my favorite pens ever, by the way. They're the Pentel Energel. I like 0.5 millimeter, but they only had 0.7, so I got 0.7, but I needed an assortment of colors because I want to do like one color for each of my classes when I get my planner. I think my planner is coming later this week but this one had a lot of colors and it was really on sale. It was like 60% off. We have this big guy. I got a pencil case. This is literally the one my sister has. She's gonna say I'm copying her but I'm not. 
I like it because it's smaller and more compact because I have a bigger pencil case, but it's really like, it's really big. And then what I'm noticing is I don't like carrying a bunch of stuff to class and stuff. So it's just a little silicone. It'll carry like all the pens I need it to carry. And I just like how cute and small it is. Next, I got more nail tips. I don't love these nail tips, but they were also really cheap. They were like $6. I don't love them because I feel like it doesn't come with that many. That could just be me. Like, I could just buy more tips. But I just got um, some new ones. And then is the planner. Aw, it's so cute. I don't know if you guys know, but I love purple. It's not even my favorite color, but it's one of my favorites. And I just feel like it looks good. Oh, this is a cute. I love the size of this. It's not too big. It just says 24.25. I feel like you guys know this about me by now. I'm pretty particular with the things I buy. So I didn't want a planner that had dumb tabs because the tabs just make me angry because I feel like they're just going to get ruined, I guess. And I didn't want one that had ugly font inside. So I wanted something very clean, minimal, pretty. And I just loved this one. So this is what like the month pages look like. I love this. This is like the weekly day to day. So you get this giant space just to write whatever that is all that came today and then i'm getting a lunch box because i'm trying to meal prep i told you guys that i'm gonna try to grocery shop like tomorrow and try to meal prep tomorrow so i'll definitely continue the video i also want to do my nails today i don't know i'll update you guys okay y'all i did take a nap but we're up and working and this is what the desk looks like this is what the desk looks like i'm organizing this organizer here and can y'all believe all of this stuff all of it fits in these little bins like isn't that crazy but i'm going through it and i thought this was funny so i showed you guys okay my card said it was full i don't know if this is literally just a me problem but it'll be like card is full i'm like okay i go in and i go to delete things i had three videos y'all so then i have to go to my mac erase the card restore the card and then put it in my camera and then it says reformat i'm like why why is it 2024 and we have to still do this to our sd cards i don't know like i was saying i'm organizing all of this and Chick-fil-A used to make us like, not make us, but we would write little nice letters to our coworkers. And I'm reading through these and why did everyone hate me? <laughs> it's always like, I hate you. And then it's like, JK, like I love working with you. Like, and these are anonymous. Anyways, I just thought these were funny. Alyssa's are nice. You do be good at your job. Thanks Rox. You're all right. Like who, it's fine. I don't care. I've grown, I've developed. Anyways. Um, we're still cleaning up. I have a bunch of just random things, like seriously. I'm trying to decide what I need and should keep like as a memento or just a pitch because I have too much stuff. I think after this, I'm just going to need to vacuum and then I do want to still do my nails. So we're doing good. We're making some progress. <laughs> pretty clean there's some clothes over there that's my sister's um vacuumed desk has a lot of like this is the stuff i'm gonna use for school so i have this book i'm gonna try to meal prep in this is my planner so cute and then this is the notebooks i'm using i have two out right now but i don't know and then i have my nail stuff because i'm gonna do my nails but i'm really happy i was able to clean my room super quickly and then there's stuff up there but i can't really put that anywhere so it's staying up there so it doesn't look super clean but it's clean hey y'all it's the next morning and i just or i am uploading my video right now this video i'm kind of excited about because i don't know if you guys know this but i like talking about money so i decided to do a little like financey video i don't want any finance hater or finance bros in my comments though sorry it's still pretty early so i'm still waking up but i was supposed to get this video up yesterday but it's fine i'm gonna be up today i don't know how i feel about this thumbnail either but i don't do finance videos like what is the thumbnail supposed to be today i am going to finish doing this and then i'm going to go grocery shopping i need to continue writing down like the stuff i want to get i guess a grocery store list like whatever but there are specific things i need to remember to check my pantry for and then check off like i have it i don't know update you guys okay guys i swear i'm about to go grocery shopping and this vlog is going to be more than just me sitting at my desk but okay did i even update you guys i didn't organize this it looks a little crazy i guess but like it's pretty organized i don't know um 
I think I've decided on returning this little guy. I love it, but I don't love it. So. I just want a Canon G7X, but they're a thousand dollars. Also, I did my nails. I went with blue. I love this blue. Okay, guys, we changed, so we look a little more presentable. I am going to go to Kroger because I don't know. I just feel like Kroger is a good grocery store, so we're gonna go there. On the menu is going to be sushi, of course. However, I'm looking it up on Google, and it says like salmon and tuna can only stay fresh in the fridge for up to two days. Days. so that might need to be like Monday and Tuesday's meal and then I'm going to do some sort of Asian chicken probably teriyaki with rice and vegetables but yeah I'm obviously gonna get some more yogurt and then some fair lifes because I've already been buying those but I will see you guys at the grocery store okay guys I'm at Kroger and it looks pretty busy, so I don't know how much we'll be able to vlog, but I'll definitely give you guys a haul, so let's go in. Okay, I'm back. I know I've literally been in my car this whole time, but I got the stuff, and I honestly did pretty good. It was busy, but it wasn't, like, overwhelming. Obviously, wanting to make sushi, I think I have to go to the Asian market, because they didn't have seaweed paper. Like, I don't know. I've also never been to this one, but it's the closest one to me, so we're gonna go. Hey y'all, I'm home now, and I'm looking a little warm, but it's fine. I'm gonna do a grocery haul. I got everything that I needed to get, Loki. We'll just start with me. I got, um, I don't know how I feel about this. I went to Kroger, and this just looked like the best one, I guess. This is just regular salmon, center cut, $6.50. And then I got two things of chicken breast because it was buy one, get one free, and I was like, okay. Just got those two meats, and then I got two of my favorite yogurts. I grabbed four of these Fairlife protein shakes because they were not on sale. So that means I paid like $4 each and yeah. Next I got two avocados to make the sushi. I tried to get the hardest ones, I don't know. And then I got three potatoes. I could have gotten a bag, but I just was meal prepping for this week alone. So I was like, I'll just get three. And then they didn't really have a big bag of assorted vegetables like I thought they would. So I got this one and this has all the good veggies. And then I had to get some broccoli because I love broccoli. It's probably my favorite vegetable. I didn't feel like making a sauce, so I spent $4 on a Peter Chang's teriyaki sauce. And hopefully this is good. For my snack of the week, like I said, I do have some stuff in the pantry, but I decided to try some cheeses. I went over to my sister's house to babysit my nephew, and she had these cheeses in her pantry, and they were really good, so. Mmm. They're just extra cheesy. Okay, I don't know if I'm doing this right at all, but they told me to cover the salmon in like salt and sugar, and then I'm gonna put this in the fridge. So I really didn't know that I would have to wait for the salmon. So I'm just gonna get working on like my meal prepping foods. So we're gonna do chicken and rice. I have a giant bag of rice, and then I also have an Instapot. And I don't really know how many cups I wanna do. Okay guys, we're doing good so far. I've yet to mess up anything. Rice chicken this is almost done actually i'm gonna put the sauce on and we got some potatoes going over here waiting for the oven to preheat and then i'm gonna do my veggies hey guys this is how the first roll of sushi turned out i feel like you're always told not to overfill them so i did a little bit but i definitely could have done more because it's like all rice i'm also scared to try this salmon sushi taste test i'm honestly only gonna try one because i'm scared the salmon is bad here's what they look like and I got some wasabi and soy sauce. Okay, yum. Look at this guy. I don't like it, guys. I really don't like it. Okay. I don't know if I showed how the chicken turned out, but it looks really good. And then I'm doing the rice, broccoli. This just came out of the microwave. And then I have the potatoes, but I'm gonna put them in a separate thing, I think. Okay, the sushi might not have turned out the best, but look at these bowls. I think they look amazing, and I had a lot of extra veggies. I think moral of the story is I should just buy sushi because it's worth the $10, and I will continue to do so. But I'm just gonna package up these potatoes and then clean up the kitchen. Okay, I packaged these guys up, looks so good, and then here are like the other sides, I guess. I have the potatoes and I have two Cheez-Its, two pretzels. I know there's only four meals. I'm definitely thinking that at least three days out of the week, like I'll make something at home or I just won't need something that's like grab and go. But I am so happy with how these turned out and I'm just gonna stick them in the fridge and eat them throughout the week. Hey guys, I just got back from hanging out with Joe and I have one more Amazon package before I end off this vlog. I can't tell how crazy this video was, but hopefully it was somewhat cohesive. Let's open her up. 
Gosh, this box cutter actually stinks. I don't know who got it on me. Someone at work. Firstly, I got another pair of black biker gym shorts because I don't know where mine went. I'm gonna assume my sister took mine, but I needed a new pair of just black ones. And these are honestly my favorite ones I found so far. They're from Un the Wee, Un the Wee, but they're really like soft because I really like Arola, Arula, but they like are kind of rough. I don't know. It's not the dream fabric. The dream fabric is really soft. It's like the intense, I think. But this is like a good medium. Like it's buttery smooth and it sticks to your body. And these don't ride up actually. And I have pretty thick thighs, so. Love these. And of course there's a little butt scrunch. Second and last thing I got was some glass food containers. And I don't want anyone in my house stealing these. These are all mine. Um, you guys saw my plastic ones I have. Those are just the families. And that is for like meal prepping. So here's what my plan is. Like I can meal prep meal prep but then i also just want to be packing my lunch and packing my dinners and just making food from home so i also have these glass ones if i'm just like i have time to make food before i leave the house you know i don't know if that makes sense but oh wait these are bigger than i thought i need to read the sizings okay let me pull them all out okay these are a good size though like this is perfect so i just got a set of three but what i liked about all of these was that they had a different amount of compartments i guess so there's just a big one salad rice bowl i don't know big one this is probably the one i'll be using the most big compartment smaller side compartment and obviously we like that it's glass versus the plastic, but I got these today and I already meal prepped, so. And the last one is just three compartments, good for snacks. Yeah, so that's all I got. I know this isn't like a traditional getting ready for back to school, like usually I'd be school supply shopping, but no, I'm meal prepping because I'm in college. But hopefully it was still somewhat enjoyable. I'll try to vlog tomorrow, tomorrow's my first day of school, but I am 90% sure it's gonna be really boring and it's just gonna be me like trying to figure out my classes and realizing that 16 credits is too much. But but it's okay. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll see you in my next vlog. Bye-bye.